Hello people, it's not magic, it's science. Today, we are going to discover how a balloon can actually move black this black pepper without even touching it. And today, here's how. First, okay, first let me show you, but first let me tell you about this. Alright. Today we're learning about static electricity. Oh wait, this is about static electricity. Static electricity. Tra static electricity is when charges build when up. When charges build up on an object. On an object. What my dad's gonna do. What my dad is going to do. He's gonna rub this yellow balloon. He's gonna rub this yellow balloon on my head. Rubbing this balloon. Rubbing on my this head. balloon on my head. We'll put electrons on the balloon. It will put electrons on balloon on the balloon. But before we do that, I am going to sprinkle this pepper on it. Wait, how much should I put on? Okay, I'm gonna put this out. Okay, I'm is going to rub the balloon, which is going to put all electrons on it. Do it. Alright, now my dad is going to use the balloon and try to pick up the pepper. without even touching it. And the balloon has electrons, so it makes the pepper move on the balloon. Because the balloon is negatively charged. Because the balloon is negatively charged and the pepper is positively charged. And opposites attract. And, and opposites attract. Let's see it again. Just like magnets. Very true, just like magnets. Try it again to show them. So you let's rub it on your head so it can build up static electricity. So this is the positive magnet, and the balloon is a negative magnet. No, they're not magnets, but it's kind of like that. Yeah. Just pretend. Look. Look at that. Now that is, now that is a positive and a negative electron, a negative charges combining together. That's why it makes the, this why the plus and the minus are in a one part like this and the plus and the negative and the minus. What do you say at the end of these things? Well, that's it for now. It's not magic, it's science. Bye, see you next time.